What is up, YouTube? This is Andrew Twenty Four. Wow, here we're back with another episode of Rust. We're back here. Um, I got a new keyboard today, actually, so I'm kind of excited to show it off. Oh, okay then. Okay, so I'm just gonna say it right now. The server got wiped, so I built a new house. I'm trying to get my supplies back up to the level it was at before. Some I found actually something interesting off camera. Um, I found a supply signal, which basically can call in an airdrop at any time I want. Yay! Okay, so that's not really that important at the moment. Um, I have hiccups though. So. Okay. So, oh. and they have to kill it. You know. gather this, get our resources up. Because we're going to eventually have to make a furnace. Might not have it. Um, we have to have, uh, like the low fat fuel or something like that. I don't know what it's called. Specifically, but we should just stock up on this right now because I'm sure we're going to need that. I'm trying to get more wood. <clears throat> so we can make a furnace. Workbench, I mean. Then we can make a furnace. I think it's the other way around. I'm not too sure. We have to get those two things there. I think we can build them right now. Yeah, I think we have enough stuff actually, so. We can try. Let's see. Workbench, workbench, workbench. Uh, furnace. Let's make the little gray fuel. Let's see much we need while we're out here. And we just need one more, so it's not that hard. We need a workbench. We have enough. So that's kind of going to be our goal right now, is just to get a lot of wood and materials. Just to look at this. Resource Valley right here, guys. The house is actually like one more foundation bigger. Um, I, was, I don't have that much. I didn't have wood at the time. So none of it was spawning, and it was really, I was really surprised actually. So now we are gonna set up house two and make it more better in a way. We have to really gain up on this freaking emphasize this a little bit more. Yep. And we have to build a lot more spikes to put around uh, another wood gate thing. Oh, look at this. Look at this. This is sensational. Sensational. Oh my god. Look at this wood pile. They're scattered. But there's so many, man. We have a lot of wood by the time we come back. Lots of wood. Cheesing? Are you kidding me? Damn, I also got my new keyboard today, so I'm kinda excited for that. I don't know. This makes a cool noise. Makes a cool noise. For sure. For show. Sure. Can also go looting for a little bit too. I'm gun ready to kill any zombies because I'm not really optimistic about those bitches. But you can check out the hangar. Razor Black Widow. It's a very nice keyboard. I highly recommend it. It's a bear there. It's actually pretty good. I can. I need to look up and get some more Kevlar recipes too. That'd be very nice. Very nice indeed. So the server got wiped. Um, I think there's no decay. That's why the server owner wanted to make it a little bit more like truer, a little bit, I guess. So he added, yeah, I think the decay thing that Gary added was kind of retarded in a way. No offense, but I don't really like that idea because in real life, wood does not decay that fast. Wood takes a little bit longer, and that just seems unrealistic in a way. So, just trying to voice out my opinion, you know, get the word out. I know he's trying to make a realistic aspect to this game, but that kind of stuff does that doesn't cut it in my books. That just sounds weird. 
Oh, gun crate. What is this? Large. I already have this. It's kind of weird how I keep getting dupes. Like, I have a lot of duplicates now, like duplicates and crap. So, it's getting kind of annoying though. No way. Let's get some of this. I need to have to head to a rat town sooner or later. I remember last time there was like filled with bases here. Not anymore. No Cerritos. Rad pills. Check out the zombie camp they have it going over there. Yeah, everything's kind of like gone now, pretty much. <clears throat> You got a gun, I really want to get a hollow sight on this gun. Because it is literally going to be the most beast gun ever. It's really good for medium range, especially. Oh, we got a couple of crap stuff there. Crap shacks right there. So maybe we'll go check that out. I'm trying to avoid this stuff. My ear's itchy. God damn it. It's like the worst problem. Literally, it is the worst. We can get this pig, that'll be amazing. It'll be truly amazing. <laughs> okay, let's check these places out. Sometimes they carry like good loot, food, stuff like that, in that nature. We got gunpowder. Take that and take it. Take it. It's also, also nice to make shells at the time, I guess. Uh, what do we have here? Flares. I'll take it. It's, it's okay, I guess. It's not really the best loot you can find in the game. Um, they seem that they can, um, they can, hold on, yeah, I just like typing, <laughs> I really didn't care about the question, I just want to type, that is, it, why? Sounds pretty cool, you know? Yeah, so we're gonna hit this little place and I'm gonna like kind of kind of order outline it a little bit. Let's see if we find a good ideal weapon would be binoculars. That'd be kinda sick in a way. Got a lot of zombies this in this area right now. Which is actually a good thing. Like so I can check kinda like the middle area where the oil tanks are actually are. Okay, stop there. Do more bullets. Check this area really quickly. So we don't get caught. Any for an hour. Let's go, let's go, let's go. That was too risky, that was too risky. My freaking I pressed escape by accident. Too dumb of me. Oh that was a black zombie too. Shit, we would have known. Especially with just an MP5. I get nervous sometimes, you know? I, I kind of, I died from like, um, like a freaking zombie one time and I was like terrified. Because I, I pretty much lost all, like a lot of my stuff that day. And it kind of sucked in a way, but, you know, you kind of just have to live through that kind of zombie, like, dying from zombies. Because it is a very harsh world in this game. Highly recommend it though. If you guys don't, um, go to my Twitch channel and subscribe. Follow me there. I mean, don't subscribe. I, I really don't mind. But I don't even think I have that option, so I really don't care. It's up to you. Finally! For one of you. Okay. I know, it's like, really waste all your ammo on the dog? literally just wasted like seven minutes, so it's not that big of a loss to me. I actually just needed an animal fan in the cloth, so it's kind of why I kind of just hit that freaking dog. Get some metal ore. We can smelt it, make an M4, second M4, hopefully. And hopefully this server doesn't wipe again. Then I'll probably just leave it officially. My house is extremely hard to airdrop, airdrop, airdrop. Where, where, where? Uh, no. 
I don't know where you are. Oh my god. Where the hell are you? Oh my goodness. Where the hell is it? Freaking trees are blocking my eyesight. Uh, okay. I know where that one is. Airdrops usually like go in the same area if you guys didn't notice. Um, they like pretty much go that same area at the exact same time. Not the exact same time, but you get the point. They just go the same area. So it's kind of cool in a way. I got one and I got a supply signal, and I'm pretty. I'm looking forward to using that when there's no one on. But if there's like one person that I'm gonna like travel for and use it. <laughs> like that's the only option I got. Da 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 da. Okay, there's a deer right there. Get a gun. Look more intimidating, to be honest. Okay, we're back. Um, so uh, last time I was talking, we were heading back to the house just to drop off the stuff. Kind of give a house tour of this rust house right now. So here we are, and uh, it's kind of difficult finding the house to be honest. Um, I kind of, kind of got it now. <laughs> like it was. Uh, this is where I built my old house for sure, but. I'm not gonna build it here tomorrow, today. I mean, because it's like very, like I already have my house built over there, so there's really no point in building the same spot. Let's try and mix it up, I guess. So it's a very long way. You know, it's like takes five minutes literally to get there. Let's get the sun going down because I don't really want to deal. I'm trying to find my house. Sun's up. Oh, you have to like kind of turn. And yeah, and go up this hill, I think. And yeah, there it is. I know it's like it takes three hours literally to find a better way of getting up here. So let's just see what we can make. Yeah, I have a ton of wood, so let's make um, have our workbench. So let's put that down already. Okay. Nope. Literally make that re close furnace. Okay, let's we need one more low grade fuel. And now we can make a furnace and I kinda Okay, let's see if we can access that from the outside. No, let's block it. Okay, perfect. Okay, now we have to smelt some stuff anyways. It should take like 40 wood at least. Let's go with 90. Okay, I have to make a large storage box. Okay. Make that right there. Let's try and make this organized. Hopefully, Let's start putting some like this ain't probably be my more armory area. So let me move my guns from this box. All my like valuable crap, I guess. No, it's not that big of a armory if you guys are saying that, but it's worth a lot, I guess. Put this crap in there. This here, here. Probably in the video now because, yeah. I really need to find a silencer though. Pretty important now. Okay, we have to also make a doorway again. You guys are gonna see my awesome plan. Oh, perfect. Look at this shit. There you go. You can probably put a metal door here. Probably put some stuff here. Lower my valuable stuff here. Let's put a wooden door at the moment, man. Mine as well. Couldn't break it down later if we wanted to, anyways. Wooden door. There you go. Perfect. Now, pretty much. It's gonna be a very long process for somebody trying to break down the house. It's not really actually worth it, anyways. So, 
yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Goodbye. Leave a like, comment, subscribe, and see you later.